Hey guys, just a quick video because I didn't find any of these online. At work sometimes we get batches of computers from refurbishing companies and among one of those um, there was a computer, an HP RP5810, which had the startup password so we couldn't boot without inputting the password, which no one knew. So usually on HP's there is a password reset jumper. We just take the jumper out or in, turn the computer on and it resets the password. However, there's uh, an additional setting, at least on these models, which they call stringent password. And that means even the BIOS jumper, that password reset jumper, won't reset the password. Um, there are a couple of posts on HP forums and other forums, but uh, the consensus is that you have to pretty much change the motherboard, which in this case is, is not viable because computers um, in bulk, they are significantly cheaper than than a replacement used motherboard. So it was the computer was trash anyway. So I decided to do something cheeky. I'm pretty sure they had to store the password on the BIOS flash because I didn't find any other storage on the motherboard. So what I did was unsolder the flash, um, erase it, and I went ahead, downloaded an HP BIOS update. If you extract that update file, there is exactly 16 megabyte file inside. And I just programmed this file on the flash using my cheap programmer at TL866. I resoldered the BIOS chip on the motherboard. I turned the computer on. Uh, it restarted like five or six times, I don't know why. And then suddenly it just started up and it appears to work. There is something, some things are kind of weird. It looks like it's, the computer is on some sort of engineering mode, but well, it works. So if you are in the same position, don't throw the computer out, try this first.